Thank you, Will. Today is a very historic day for uh, a number of reasons. In Ottawa, Canada, a treaty is going to be signed. Nearly two-thirds of our casualties in Vietnam were a result of landmines. Ninety percent of those landmines were manufactured uh, that component parts or were manufactured in the United States. So that is a, indeed a tragedy. Um, the tragedy behind that tragedy is the fact that the United States is not in Ottawa today as a signatory. In Ottawa, Canada, a treaty is going to be signed by nearly 120 states to ban the export, production, use, and transfer of landmines. It is also very historic in the sense that it is the first arms control treaty with a victim assistance component in it. Little do people realize that there are nearly 300 landmines. in 1993 in Somalia working on micro-enterprise projects. What I think this exhibition here today does is put faces on those statistics. Um, the people uh, who are responsible for this art, many of them children, come from different countries with different cultures, different histories, different backgrounds. But we can all understand what they're saying. Um, it's important that we realize that these are people that are involved in this. If this were taking place in Boston or New York or Washington, it would be a national crisis. Pressure and isolate. I join with others in saying that we very much hope to see rapid response on all of the holdout countries, including our own, and very rapid response on initiatives to raise ex extensive funds for not only demining but victim assistance.